Hi guys, so today I have a video that's a little bit different. Well, not really, I do reviews all the time, but a different subject. Um, we are going on a trip very soon here, and over the years our luggage has just gotten destroyed, and there's like, it just mismatches, and I was like, let's just start over. So uh, I picked this up recently, it's a Badgley, oh, Badgley Mishka? I don't even know how to pronounce the Badgley part. But, um, set. So there are three luggages uh, in this, so the outer one, obviously, the larger one. I think it's 27 inches, but I'll get that info for you in just a minute. And then uh, a smaller one, and then like a carry-on type. But they're all um, nestled in there. I did pick this up on HSN, so I'll link in the description box. Um, those would be affiliate links, which means I'll make a small commission if you're purchasing through those links. Having said that, I did see that these are also available on Macy's, because I was looking for reviews, since on HSN there are like no reviews, <laughs> not even like, you know, three stars, four stars, five stars, like no one has reviewed them. And then on Macy's, a lot of them are not compensated, but they did get taken from like a different site, from like a travel site, those kinds of things. So I'm like, eh. So um, they do have this kind of thing in like tons of designs. And this one I had to pick, even though they do have one that looks more like like something you see like on a Tarzan movie, I don't know, it's like beige, or like beautiful like brown buckles, and I really liked it, but my husband was like, nah, I don't want to carry that around, so <laughs> I picked the one that's least, um, I guess something I would prefer, to be honest, uh, what I mean is like l less feminine, just kind of generic, right? But I like the style of this, so that's why I chose these guys. Um, they have wheels, as you can see, so all it was, it was in this box, <laughs> and it's a huge box, and I just pulled it out, it was wrapped in plastic, but I already took that off. Uh, only because I was going to go ahead and use them or, you know, open them up. And I thought, oh, well, maybe I'll do a review because, you know, again, this, um, I don't really see any. Ten years of warranty, which is kind of typical for luggage. And so, yeah, let me remove this little tag. Oh, and it was easy to remove. I do not like those kinds of tags when it, like, hurts your hands. Um, so there is uh, a multi-level trolley system in here, <laughs> which I think it just goes up in two different lengths, like up and then further up. And we'll talk about that in the handle. Ultra strong, it says, fully feature, uh, featured interior, fully featured interior, I don't know. Zipper divider, mesh pocket, elastic straps, eight spinner wheels. Eight spinner wheels? Oh, yeah, I see. <laughs> okay. I was like, there should be four, but um, they're like double. I don't know if you can see there's one and then another one, so it's separate. It's not one wheel. Uh, yeah, uh, smoothly roll in 360 while well, strong enough to handle over packing. And then these are the colors that's available in, and it is available in other colors, and they were really pretty, but again, I went with black because, you know, my husband approved of that one there. Uh, the smaller one, let me see, um, is a 20-inch body, a 24-inch body, and a 28-inch body. And the, what they're showing you here is like the actual measurements of the smaller one. It's 22 by 9 by 14. Again, that's what you need for a carry-on, right? The largest. The middle size one is 26 and a half by 10 by 17 and a half. And it weighs about 8 pounds, sorry, the carry-on weighs about 6.2 pounds. And the largest 28 inch, see I said 27, but it's 20 inch, is actually 30 by 12 by 20 and it weighs about 9.8 pounds, which is very interesting because this morning I was at Walmart and I was looking at their luggage because I had seen this one luggage that they have that's so cute, it has like clear outer, it looks just like this, but they'll pretend it's clear. And on the inside it has like an aluminum looking kind of interior, I don't know. And those were like in the 140s. I think they're usually like 169 for the bigger one, and they were on sale for in the 140. And um, they weighed like 11 pounds, the largest one. So that's already you're already shaving off a couple pounds on this one. The other one was almost 12. It was like 11 point something. Um, in just the um, luggage itself, right? Which is a bummer. So you definitely want to max out, <laughs> keep this lightweight. The other thing is kind of weird. It is hard shell, but you can squeeze it. And literally everything that they had at Walmart that looked like this, or even, I guess, Target I had seen before. There are some that are hard, 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 but apparently this is the way people are doing now, or what people are doing, I don't know. Uh, again, this is the Wonder Collection Expandable ABS. Lightweight, ultra strong, water resistant, and the eight spinner wheels. So what I'm going to do, and maybe you can see my little slippers here, is open this guy up. So, again, we have this. Telescoping handle. Let me see if we're still in frame. So whenever you pull this up, it's not going to come up, right? You have to push that down. You can bring it up to here. That's like maybe six inches. And then give it a squish, and it comes up a little further, right? So that's it. So to get it back down, you would squeeze it again and then pop it down. Um, I like the design. It's pretty cool. Uh, let's see. It does expand. This has a nice feel to it. Um, but again, you know, it just <laughs> has that collapsibility there. So these are the... 
zippers. It does have handles on both uh, the side and the top, which is nice. And I was curious about this because it was hard to see in the pictures. These do meet up. I know it might be hard to see because of where I am. Let me see if I can close up a little bit. Close up. Nope, that's... Oh, there we go. That's the close up. Right there. So they do meet up and so you can lock it. It was hard to tell in those pictures. So it has a set of loops, a set of loops, and they nestle in together and you can lock that. So that's really good. Okay. So let's see. <laughs> I'm probably going to have to lay this down, which I don't want to, but I will. Okay, so I'll be right back, guys. I'm just going to lay this out. Okay, sorry. I turned off my notifications on my camera because I was recording my son's concert the other day. And now I'm like, is it recording or not? Because it's not beeping. <laughs> so, okay, I unzipped it. It does have, like, the little, um, just, like, little plastic tabs here to keep it nice. You know, so that when you open it up, it doesn't just hit each other, and maybe you can lean it on there. It's not a big deal, because you're not actually leaning it on the suitcase itself. So let's open this guy up. And again, those double wheels. What I do like about that is, like, well, I just like it. <laughs> they do roll around. I, you know, I do like when wheels are kind of tucked into the luggage, because I feel it's safer, but... Oopsie, sorry, guys. That's what, how it is. Uh, I'm going to move this instead of moving the luggage. I was going to move the luggage, but I'm like, let's not drag it on the floor. All right, so... Again, we have this interior, so this does have a zip opening in here, I suppose. Um, this zip's closed also. It's about, you know, five inch gusset there or space. Uh, and then there's also another zipper here for your other little garments. Hopefully you guys can hear me. Sorry. And as you can see, this one's wrapped. And basically the outside one was also wrapped just the same way. Let's pull this out. And she's just as pretty, but right there, just a little smaller again. Very, very pretty. I mean, they feel sturdy. They have some give. The things that scare me like that is like when they go on the plane, or they're just going to bash it with something else and it breaks a wheel or something. But what I'm going to do is not upload this video, and I should have said at the beginning, until I come back from my trip. And <laughs> we are going to Hawaii, and it is not direct flight because we planned it with like two weeks in advance, two and a half weeks in advance. So... Uh, it's going to be transferred once on the way out, it's going to be transferred again once on the way back, right? So the initial flight and then to the second flight uh, on the way out and back. So it's going to be moved around quite a bit by the <laughs> airline, so that hopefully I'll let you know kind of how it did. Um, it's really pretty though. And, oh, I didn't notice on the outside one. Does it also say this beautiful thing here? I don't know, but it does say Bag Miska there. Again, just as pretty, and I give you guys the measurements. And then, of course, when you open this one up, we have the other smaller one inside. So let me open it up, and I'll be right back. Okay, so the second large one looks exactly the same on the inside as this guy. Now that we have them out, I'll talk about the inside on the other side in just a minute. But this is your carry-on. And they all look exactly the same and so cute. Oh my goodness, I love this. This is adorable. Um, looks really cute. They all have expanders. So, of course, with the carry-on... You know, that might be a little iffy <laughs> if you're going to expand it um, because they need it to be a certain size, right, to go in the uh, compartment there. But we have this guy, again, also a little telescoping handle. Oh, this one telescopes even taller because, of course, the larger <laughs> suitcase is already, what was it, 28 inches, 30 inches tall. So um, you don't need to telescope that much. But this one does telescope quite a bit. Super cute. And the inside of this guy... And the other side also has the zipper, you know, at the base, and then it also has these ties, or uh, what do you call them, ties, straps, I guess, to hold your clothes in or whatever you have in there. So yeah, I mean, they're lovely. I love that the, um, even the zippers on the inside are really nice and fancy. I don't know if you can see the zipper there. It looks just like the one on the outside. So what I'm going to say is wish us luck. <laughs> I'm going to try it out. Uh, generally, we used to just use fabric um, luggage and and they were fine, you know. I uh, just wanted something pretty today. So that's what I chose. Again, they have tons of different colors of this. There's molded ones like this, right, where it has the design. There are, like, cheetah prints. There are, like, more, like, childish prints. There are, like, gold ones, rose gold. All kinds of metallics, all kinds of finishes, all kinds of design. It's crazy. Um, but they're all essentially the same. And they all cost the same, right? These, like, three-piece sets by uh, Mishka here. I don't even know, Badgley, whatever it is. So... All right, when I come back, I guess what I'll be showing you is how it did on the trip. 
All right, guys, I'll be back. Okay, we literally just arrived and my uh, luggage made it ahead of me, but these are the items I had shown at the beginning of the video here. They got out to Waikiki perfectly. They arrived perfectly. They are overstuffed. I mean, I put too much stuff in these things. This one actually closed up a little bit, which is interesting. So it must have shifted. This one, I mean, look at to the brim. And, and my husband was concerned that <laughs> these were going to split or something. But it looks perfectly great. And then um, easy to maneuver. They've been wonderful. Um, this little carry-on one. I have it expanded. It's all full of macadamia nuts and um, cookies from the Honolulu Cookie Company. And while we were there, we also picked up this guy, which I want to mention came from the ABC stores um, that they have out there in Hawaii. Uh, ubiquitous, I suppose, in Hawaii. And I think it was $135, which I think isn't too bad. Um, it's huge. I don't know if you see it's as big as that guy. It looks bigger to me, though. I don't know. Um, it's from Movera, Hawaii, it says here. And I just want to show it to you guys because I picked it up because I had to use, like, I had to... I used, okay, I nestled this one inside this one just to put the clothes in it so that I would have an extra luggage and I still needed this much more for like everything that we needed, bought and all that kind of stuff that we're bringing back. So um, it arrived really nicely too, as you can see, and it works really well. I uh, have a little handle it has on the side, nice little wheels. So, you know, if you have to get something from the ABC store, don't fear that it's not going to be good. I mean, it's not cheap. So the store in, is generally inexpensive, but this piece of luggage was not super cheap. The only thing is the handle is kind of funny. It kind of wants to collapse like as you're going. It'll it'll just kind of come down like it's not doing it right now. But I guess because I'm holding it and maybe I end up pushing this and I don't notice. So, but it does have two stages. So, you know, good luggage. Really cute. <laughs> all right. So I guess that's the end of that uh, review. Again, I'll link whatever I can in the description box. And I'll see you all at the next one. Bye now.